Weighted average flotation cost is the average flotation cost of debt and equity. Since the flotation costs for issuing debt and equity are different, they need to be multiplied by their weights and then added together to get the weighted average flotation cost. The formula for weighted average flotation cost is debt divided by total assets multiplied by the flotation cost of debt and then you would add that to equity divided by total assets multiplied by the flotation cost of equity. Let's try an example. If FFF Corporation is raising $10 million to finance a new project and their target capital structure is 60% debt and 40% equity with the flotation cost being 5 and 8% respectively, what would their weighted average flotation cost be? The weighted average flotation cost would be 6.2%. The way we figure this out is by using the formula that we just showed you. For the first part of the formula, you can see that our debt is 60% of our capital structure. And the cost of debt is 5%. So we would do 0 0.60, which represents 60%, and we'd multiply that by 0 0.05, which represents 5%. Then we would add that to 0 0.40 times 0 0.08. 0 0.40 is 40% of our equity, and the cost of equity is 0 0.08 or 8%. Their flotation cost for raising $10 million of external funds would be $620,000. This means that they would not have $10 million after paying the flotation cost. How much money would they need to sell in bonds and equity to acquire $10 million after flotation costs? To solve this, we're going to use some simple algebra. All that we do is we take the amount of money that the company is going to need after flotation cost, in our case it's $10 million. Then we're going to set it equal to 1 minus the rate of flotation cost, in our case it's 6.2% or 0 0.062. So we're going to take 1 minus 0 0.062 multiplied by the variable x. So you can see our formula is going to be $10 million is equal to 1 minus 0 0.062 multiplied by x. When we solve this equation, we find that FFF Corporation needs to raise $10,660,981. They must sell $10,660,981 and stocks to have $10 million after flotation cost. We already know that their target capital structure is 60% debt and 40% equity. $10,660,981 times 60% equals $6,396,588.60 of debt that should be issued. $10,660,000 $981 minus $6,396,588.60 equals $4,264,392.40, which should be issued as equity.